Hey, so today I'm here to do a video for you. Basically, I filmed three different videos today, and uh, for this video, I'm just going to show you how I do my eyebrows and how I make them look on fleek. Uh, if you don't like how my eyebrows look, then I would not suggest watching this video because it would be probably useless for you. But if you do want to see how I can, you know, get my eyebrows to look like this, then um, just keep watching. Okay, so as you can tell, I barely have any eyebrows to work with, I know. They're already small, plus I shaved off the end of them the other day because I couldn't get them the shape that I wanted with my end on. So that happened. Um, but yeah, let's just uh, get started. So first I'm going to take this Ulta Ultra Slim Brow Pencil in the shade Dark Brown. This is very tiny. It's got a very, very tiny little tip. And I love this formula. Oh my god, it's so good. So, first, I'm going to start out by kind of, I take um, this pencil and use it on the end of my nose to like the end of my eye, and that'll kind of show me where I want the end of my brow to be. So I just like draw a line right there. I know that's kind of giant, but it's fine, it'll wipe away. Okay, so next I'm just gonna take this tiny brow pencil and start drawing out the shape that I want my eyebrows to be. Because since I barely have any, like I just, like outline where I want the eyebrow to like actually be. Um, if you have like large eyebrows to begin with, I would suggest you like pluck them to be the shape that you want and well like how I found the shape that I want, I went on like Instagram and was just looking at a bunch of eyebrows and like once I found someone who had like awesome eyebrows, I decided that I was gonna like try to create that on my face. So that's what I suggest you do if you don't know exactly what like kind of look you want. So yeah, I'm just going to start drawing. I'm going to bring mine down pretty low because it helps me have more of an arch. I am legit sweating so bad right now. I think I'm going to have to like open the door. Wow. It's very cool now, but you can see the outside of that door now. Um, so yeah, I'm going to go back to drawing. Okay, so I start by making a line like that and then just drawing it up right to the arch of my actual eyebrow. It's okay if you mess up, like, the shape because in the end we're gonna go over, like, and, like, fix it all up with concealer, so it'll be okay. So what I do is make sure that this arch down here is, like, lower or equal to the tail end of my brow because I really don't want the end to go down very low. I don't know, I just don't really like how that looks. My skin is like very wet <laughs> right now because one, I'm sweating and two, I just put on self tanner and moisturizer so it's like really easy for me to just wipe this right off. Okay, and then next I'm just going to like trace the top of where I want the brow to be. Okay, so then I have something that looks like this. Now I'm gonna go like do this other eyebrow really quick and then I'll be back to finish talking about this one. Okay, so this looks really weird right now, but okay, I like try to get them as even as possible whenever I'm doing this. Like I'll like raise my eyebrows up and stuff because it like helps me get the shapes equal on both sides. And even if it's not, it's okay. Like it takes me forever to try to get them to be even because like I don't have my own brows to just fill in and be done with like I'm actually creating eyebrows but um, next I'm just going to move on and I'm going to start filling in the end of my brows with this tiny pencil that I'm using right now because it makes it a little bit easier than whenever I go in with a bigger pencil because this one's like nice and small and can fit really nicely right here also what I do is like turn my head sideways and I can see like I try to get these to be like as straight as possible like it's hard to explain. Whenever I turn, I try to make this line completely straight going up and this line completely straight going up and like no weird arches happening in places that I don't want them. Okay, next I'm going to take the Anastasia Perfect Brow Pencil in this shade Granite and this is like black. The thing about this pencil is it doesn't get very sharp, but I do like the formula and everything. Like, you have to actually sharpen this one. 
but even when I do it doesn't get that sharp so that's why I don't outline my eyebrows with this one but I'm gonna go ahead and fill them in with this one because this shade is actually a lot more black than the other shade because the other one is obviously dark brown and this one's black of course so I'm only gonna fill them in about this far like right to where my actual eyebrows stop for everyone that would be different but yeah okay and then I'm gonna take the spoolie on this end uh, this thing is kind of harsh, I'm not going to lie. Like, it's not very harsh when you're actually using it in hairs, but I use it on my skin, so it can hurt a little. But I just take this and start fading this part that I just did. And then I'm going to bring it forward, and it will very lightly help me fade my eyebrow in. Because nobody wants a harsh line at the beginning of their eyebrow, that's for sure. And whenever I do this, the front of my eyebrow, like, it, it loses its sharpness of how I just threw it in. But that's whenever I go through with a concealer and fix it up. And wh whenever I'm doing this, you know, it takes some product away. And I'll just kind of put it back and then, like, you know, mess with it some more until it looks how I want it to look. And I'll take my finger and kind of just, like, fade it in on my own. Just trying to get it to like not be very harsh at all. I always end up bringing in one eyebrow farther than the other so I'll kind of like draw the line or just like something to like mark right where the middle of my forehead thing is so that I can try to make them even. Okay so now I'm going to take the, you like how I just leave that line on my forehead? I don't even care. So I'm gonna take the Anastasia Dip Brow Pomade in the shade Granite. Again this is black and I'm going to take a tiny brush I'm going to take this brush. It is really deformed right now because there's still pomade in it, but it's an angled brush. I got this from like an Ardell brow kit, but I really like this brush actually because it's really thin. So I'm going to dip this in the dip brow, dip this in the dip brow. And then I'm just going to use this to fill in the tail end because it'll really like help sharpen it and darken it up because that's where you want it to be the darkest. Okay, now I'm going to take this NYX Above and Beyond Full Coverage Concealer. Mine's in the shade Beige. And I'm going to use this to, like, carve out my brows. I'm going to take this um, weird-shaped e.l.f. brush. It's probably, like, a dollar. It's really thin and square, obviously. And I use this to just make my brows look how I want them to look. And make them look sharp and awesome. So what I do a lot whenever I'm like um, almost done with my eyebrows, I like put them in weird positions, like raise them and like then I can kind of see like where they're uneven at. I know it's kind of weird, but it really annoys me whenever they're uneven, even though I know it's like impossible to get them both even. Trust me, I spend a lot of time on it every day and it's probably not completely worth it, but it makes me feel better. Okay, so I'm done like messing with my brows for now usually what I'll do is like do them first obviously and then I'll do like my face makeup and as I'm doing my face makeup I'll see things that I want to fix with my eyebrows and then at the end of doing all of my makeup I'll put on the Anastasia Beverly Hills clear brow gel this brow gel is the best clear brow gel ever like it holds my barely the, any hairs that I have in place so yeah that's all for this uh little video of how I do my brows. I'm gonna finish my face and then I'll be back to do like an outro for you. So yeah. Okay, so this is my finished eyebrows. Um, they are as perfect as I can get them. They are not exactly the same. They never will be, it's okay. Uh, but if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe and I'll be back soon with more videos. Thanks for watching, bye.